Windows 8 and Windows Server 8, and I'm going to show you the CPU utilization in the Task Manager. You can get to the Task Manager by right-clicking on the Task Bar and choosing Task Manager or Control-Alt-Delete Task Manager options. Uh, so once you are in the Task Manager, just go ahead and click on the Performance tab, and from here we'll click on CPU, and we can see at the bottom the different CPU utilization graphs and other statistics. Uh, so here we see that we're bouncing back and forth between 1 and 2 percent is the speed of our processor. If you have multi-cores in, in a processor or multiple processors, you'll see a division for each one of those at this point. From here we see that there's 25 processes going on and there are uh, 296 threads and these uh, 8,000 8, plus handles. This is mostly just for programmers. It's not typically used uh, in regular IT administration. When a programmer creates a program, they'll want to see how much uh, thread and handle usage goes up or down. Uh, we also It also shows uptime, the amount of time that the server has been running, and uh, it shows a little bit more information over here about the, the uh, L1 and L2 cache that's on our processor over here. So uh, that's the util uh, utilization for the CPU. If you double click on the CPU, then it uh, sort of goes into a, a smaller mode here and if you double click back on it again it goes back into where it was and uh, so that is the uh, CPU uh, graph that if you double click in the graph itself it sort of breaks out into just the CPU uh, portion and if you go back double click back it goes back to the uh, full task manager